Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Gameplays on Game Boy TV edition of Metopia Production Code MII0306 DCR1518. This show will be seen 51918. Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of the Gameplays Edition of Miitopia. This is our 43rd overall episode in the series, and our 6th episode of our current season. Um, first, before we begin, I just want to take a few moments to thank Jenny, Anya, and Amy for their contribution. The last episode, we had quite a... Uh, quite... A fun time uh, filming. A lot, lots of laughs were shared. It was interesting to see Jenny and how her me character compares to her real self. Um, hopefully that this will not be uh, that th this wouldn't be the last episode that they uh, all three of them can come and commentate. I certainly would like them back um, as guests in a future episode of Metopia or any other uh, game that I decide to do a let's play or commentary on. So let's begin. Um, okay, so let's try to spend some gold on here and it looks like Amy wants some woolly claws for 920 gold. We'll raise her attack power from 43 to 49. Oh dear Mimi, why did you come back with one MP candy? We've already got a lot of those stacked. I didn't give you this money for nothing. Looks like Isaiah wants some polka dot threads. We'll raise her raise his defense from 24 to 30. Okay, good. Okay, so let's see. Um, let's see what's inside this arcade. Maybe, maybe one of those prizes would be those. Nope. It's only uh, polka dot vestments, a royal portion of experience points, one MP candy, and Jolly John tickets. Wouldn't hurt to uh, use up one, use one up. But if we get MP candy again, I mean, that's like two bad luck, uh, bad luck incidents in a row. Okay, we're not gonna get one MP candy, but we will get some. Let's give let's give it to Jenny so that he can go on vacation with Isaiah. Alright, getting there. We could set out right now. As we continue exploring the realm of the Fae. Okay, you've collected three different types of threads. The preferred clothing of the male pop star. <laughs> Okay, so I think what we've got to do here is go back to the realm of the Fae. Oh, no, sorry. To the Elven Retreat, pardon me. 
As you can see, all the points on the map have gold flags. Okay, so they're going to open up some kind of gate. Amanda, Crystal, and Lizzie. Amanda says, at last, darling. Ready, girls? Oh boy, what are we, what are they gonna do? gate can open. Wow, you three. <laughs> you, you... It's Pat Salas. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thanks for opening the door, ladies. Oh no! Pat, what are you doing? You've been a great help, fools. Weep. <laughs> uh oh, what's happened? Crystal, some. Now Crystal's face has been taken away. Let's see you try that wimpy fairy magic now. And now it's time to pay a visit to all your little elf friends. <laughs> oh man. Poor sweet Crystal H. You're not exactly catching us at our very best. We'll have to take her home. Sorry. Looks like we got our work cut out, but we've got some new areas opened. But let's first see what the Dark Lord has uh, wrecked havoc in this town. Okay, lots of faces. All those poor souls were like this when we got here. <laughs> the Dark Lord must have flown off after he had his fun. It's my duty as the eldest to clean up this mess. Are you with me, sweetie? We, of course. Let's be on board with this. I knew you wouldn't let us down. Amanda joined our party. Hooray! Lizzie G, you look after the others. Understood. Right then, let's be off. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. Okay, Scaredy Cat Anne has her face, and it's stuck, and the Dark Lord has stuck it back at the Citrus Cave. We've also got the three fans of the Fab Fairies. Nickel, whose face is going to be, okay, right there, right in the middle the pathway between the uh, uh, between the elven retreat and the citrus cave okay let's see where stupid's face is <laughs> also where nickel's face is so there's two faces in that same area and we also got Steph's face Okay, so all three of the Fab Fairies fans face, um, wow, try saying that five times fast. Uh, all located in the same location.
Okay, some of these townspeople are pretty lucky. Or elves, I should say. Grrr. Darn that stupid Dark Lord, why did he leave my face alone? I bet he doesn't think I'm important enough, right? Well, you know, your ignorance right there kind of shows you that you take a lot of things for granted. Lazy bones, bleh. Things are pretty quiet in the retreat right now. Now I should be able to nap in peace. And we also got an, the other Jenny. Jenny with a J, and her face is heading towards the east in a farther part in, I think that's Lotus Lake. But there's Lizzie, and where is Crystal's face? Alright. Alright, so Amanda, it's you, me, and the rest of our party with Amy, Isaiah, and Genevieve. Okay, the first thing we're going to do... Uh, okay, more, more uh, locations on the map have been unlocked. Hmm. Let's go right here first so that we can pretty much do a three-in-one. Get those Fab Fairy... Fab Fairy's fans face back. Okay, pretty easy enemies here. Mouthy Tomato A and B. Let's attack. One shot kills. Cutscene. So the Dark Lord was waiting for us, Amanda says. Who could have guessed? We really can't let our guard down. Do you think I'll be kicked out of the Fab Fairies? Nope, I don't think so. Aw, thank you, sweetie. You're so kind. You know, that's something, uh... Like, I could just imagine the real Amanda, like, saying it in that kind of tone. Like, you know, saying it the way... Oh! Okay, so we've got two mouthy tomatoes and two pom-poms, okay? And... We could take care of these pom-poms pretty easily. 25 damage. Amy's gonna prepare for a pretty strong attack. Sharpening her claws, Isaiah will do... Oh, Genevieve will make everyone dance, or try to. Oh, everyone is... everyone is distracted. Whoa, 64 damage. Okay, Amy's gonna lend a hand to Isaiah. Who deals... The final blow. Still in one piece, says Isaiah. And... Tomato spaghetti plus 240 gold. Alright, a little divide in the path. So we've got two two ways, gold or sweets. Let's go for gold. Who wouldn't want to? Okay. Treasure chest. 
600 gold received, taking up our total up to 35,537. Which we could probably use on, obviously, expensive equipment. And we finally found an inn. So we're going to have to go back to this pathway. Just to get the other side. Okay, Mark and Mimi. And Genevieve and Isaiah. Both leveling up in friendship. To level 5 for Amy and Mark Joe. Which they learn praise together. Finally, level two. If they're finally acquainted, then they learn show off together. Okay, let's eat some grub. Okay, very rare banshee tears. So intensely full of magic, you might wail like a banshee yourself. Hmm. Let's see what Isaiah thinks. Yes. All right, plus two, right on the board. Okay, sp tomato spaghetti. Oh! How could I not like spaghetti? Tomato spaghetti. Like, that's only one of my, you know, one of my favorite foods up there with pizza and, uh, and baked ziti. Oh, man. Let's see what Jenny thinks. Oh! Come on! Me and Jenny? Hating spaghetti? Alright. Okay, bitingly bitter tea. A rare one. Just a thing to calm you down after a hard day adventuring. Alright. At least somebody here likes something. Okay, let's see if we can. Who, who needs anything? Okay, Isaiah looks like he wants some wild threads for 730 gold, which will raise his defense from 30 to 36. Okay, let's change that to blue. Match his outfit. And let's see what is inside this arcade. Okay, so we've got more Jolly John tickets. Uh, Grub would be a two-star butterfly honey. Let's actually, first, before we do that, let's rearrange... Let's rearrange the roommates here. How about we have Genevieve roommate with Amy, and then Isaiah and I will be together in one room. So that way, if we get uh, if we get the Jolly John tickets, we could use them on either Mark or Isaiah or Genevieve and Mimi. I like this episode so far. Okay, HP banana. use one more in fact we're actually lacking more in bananas than our than MP candy okay Amy and Jenny will be on a trip together Alright, let's go back to this point on the map, um, just so that we can get the sweets. We might, 
will be battling something. Two mouthy tomatoes. Which are definitely easy to defeat now. The stronger that we get. Alright. Level 9. More of the same again, just like the last battle. Like, I mean, the last time we were here. Okay, level 7 for Jen. Two fluffy marshmallows plus 240 gold. And we can finally, like, go to the sweets part. One MP candy. So all those two battles just to get one additional MP candy. But it does ensure us that we do get a gold flag at this uh, location. <laughs> so. We're going to try this again. Wait. Wait. Okay, so actually, I thought I fed, I thought I didn't feed Amy or Isaiah the uh, tomato spaghetti. Forest nuts, rare, full of healthy fats and oils. Nuts will keep you fuller longer. Okay. Okay, let's see what Jen thinks of fluffy marshmallows. Okay, I'll just give myself a hobgob donut. And a fl another fluffy marshmallow to Mimi. <laughs> now let's see who needs anything. Who needs uh who needs equipment? Okay, protractor fan. 570 gold will raise her attack from 23 to 28 and magic from 24 to 29. Yes. Okay, an HP banana for a hundred gold. Okay. We need, we actually need a lot more HP bananas than MP candy, as I've said, and he, Isaiah came back with three, so that's a pretty good deal. Okay, now we're pretty much stocked. I think we're the strongest that we can be at the moment, so that we can battle, uh, finally rescue some of the, uh, faces that have been stolen by the Dark Lord.
Jenny and Amy. That's the biggest tomato I've ever seen. Or did we just shrink? Ha 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 ha. <laughs> It was just a dream. <laughs> oh man, pom pom, two mouthy tomatoes and a twerky. Let's defeat that hideous figure first. And we're two away from getting our next uh, upgrade. Gift of Divine Power, that is. And my mistake, that's a pom pom pom. There's three of them, actually. Turkey curry and more tomato spaghetti plus 156 gold. Whoa. Tomato Brothers. Okay. Love this battle music. Glad it's back for our third for its appearance in its third season. Oh my! I'm pretty concerned about Jenny because... It seems as her defense is not very strong at all. I'm gonna have to use a lot of these MP sprinkles. Okay. Twenty. Okay, twenty six. Seventeen. Another royal rave dealing twenty two damage. Oh, oh, Isaiah loves tomatoes. Healing melody, everyone. Everyone gets cured in some way, or healed in some way. Thank you, Amanda. Come on, Mimi. Encourage us, Jenny. Alright, got the mojo back, and... Another level up in terms of friendship, up to level 3 now. Learn warning together. Mimi's turn. New skill. Playful antics. Okay, an encore performance. Okay, so let's think this through for a moment. We could use some MP sprinkles and we could use that on Amy. Get her back up to 16. In the meantime, let's see what kind of magic I could use. I could only cure. I can't calm or I can't resurrect yet. But we're halfway through this battle, and I will deal 26 damage. Jenny will deal 21 with the Royal Wave. Oh! Oh! Okay, 
day. One life sprinkle for Amy. Oh man, I gotta still use. I, I think I should use more sprinkles just to be on the safe side. Come on. This is it. Nailed it with this battle. Okay, we got 250 experience points each and a rare tomato spaghetti. And we got Fey Jewel A, which I think will be used to open up another door. <laughs> You've rescued 850 people, gift of divine power. HP Sprinkles Upgrade Your total HP Sprinkles rose from 220 to 240. Ho ho! People's gratitude has awakened new power in you. Let's continue to smite monsters. Let's continue playing. And it looks like Amy is looking for me. And we're working out together. We need more discipline. Let's walk the path to victory. No, let's run it training time. Okay. All right. Who deserves to eat the rare tomato spaghetti, rich tomato sauce and sprinkles of cheese, and robe tender spaghetti? Okay. Jenny didn't like the regular one, but she needs some more magic power, so let's see what she thinks. Oh! Alright, at least it was plus one. Turkey curry. Let's see what Amy thinks. Okay. And let's see what Isaiah thinks of the rare Banshee Tears. Alright. And I'm just going to give myself a Goblin Ham. Okay, Isaiah looks like he wants some macho threads for 1100 gold. Raise his defense from 36 to 43. Alright. And can you buy this one for once? Okay. I knew you would.
Okay, Black Iron Fan, a morsel, budget, and MP candy. Okay, this one will go to Jenny. It will raise her attack from 28 to 33 and her magic from 29 to 33. Okay, so we're gonna embark once again, go back inside. Go back to the Oh, you've collected five different types of claws, the preferred weapon of the cat! You've collected five different types of bands, the preferred weapon of the princess! Yeah, let's go back to the album and get those faces back to those Fab Fairy fans. Oh yeah. Oh, to be saved by my lady Amanda H. I think I can die happy. You must have helped, stranger, in your own way. Here, you take this. 300 gold. And yes, let me reiterate, folks, that these Fab Fairy fans are not based off of anyone real. They are randomized. Uh, doesn't mean that there might be a look-alike somewhere around the world, but th as far as I know, these are all random, uh, random me's. Hooray! I'm saved. But more importantly, Lady Lizzie G is alive and well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Takes this as a thanks. Whoop, whoop, whoop. 600 gold. 33,361. And finally, we've got this. Step space. Step in space. Huzzah! Ah, thank you for saving me. The Fab Fairies have such incredible power. And you're no pushover yourself, stranger. You helped us a lot, so you should have this. 900 gold! By the way, is Lady Crystal H okay? Is she safe? Okay. Well, we only got a few minutes left. We only got maybe six minutes left in this episode, so I wonder... Hmm. Is that a point on the map? Whoops. Yeah, sorry about that, folks. Um, sometimes I often get confused for certain locations if they... They're one that would have a gold flag that you would achieve or not. But let's go inside. Okay. You know what we can do? We could save. We could save rescuing uh, the next face. I think it's uh, 
Anne's face in here, inside the citrus cave. Uh, and we've got a tasty snurp that we can battle. What's with all these distractions all of a sudden? Okay. Okay, Snurp Radish and a very rare Snurp Radish. And what we can do, we could go back to the inn. We can wrap up the episode by giving up, seeing who would like these Snurp Radishes. Vibrant, fresh veggies piled high for a truly top-notch salad. Okay, so actually we're we went back to the last inn that we were that we were at. So, um, so basically the stomachs are still full for our knees. So let's just give this one to Isaiah and see what he thinks. Oh, oh well. Numbers did raise though. Okay. And so that's going to do it for this episode of the Gameplays edition of Metopia. Um, so next Saturday, we're cranking out these episodes. Uh, next Saturday, a brand new episode, episode 44 of the Gameplays edition of Metopia, where we finally get to uh, battle and get uh, some more faces that are part of the Elven Retreat. Uh, so thanks for watching. Uh, you have a Good night, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy the warm weather, um, and we'll see you next week.